Hello YouTube, my name is Daniel and welcome back to another video. In this video I'm going to be showing you how we can play local audio files on Angular. Before we get started you need to add any audio files that you want to play to your res directory and this needs to be in the raw folder. Um, the resource type for this is raw as well so just add that resource directory and then add your audio files in there. This will work for both mp3 and WAV formats. And to get started, we need to declare an instance of um, a media player. So I'm going to use a late init var for this as we initialize this in our onCreate. Um, so private late init var, media player, and that is of type media player. And in order to play the sound, we're going to do it on a button click. And this is on our Pokemon app, which I've shown in some other videos. And we are going to play the sound when we click on this Pokeball here. So we get, so we're no longer going to navigate to this activity. It will just play the sound for us. And that is done in this click listener. So I'm just going to comment out the code. Now we're going to initialize the media player here. And firstly, we're just going to check if it has not been initialized. So if this media player is initialized. And we'll initialize it, media player. And now we're going to create our instance of the media player. So that will be media player.create, pass in the context, and now we can pass in the file. The file will be in r.raw and then your audio file. And that will be the media player created. Now, firstly, I want to check whether the media player is playing or not. And you can do that by accessing this value here, media player is playing. And if it's already playing, what we want to do is pause the media player. We don't want to stop it because the stopping of the media player starts the, um, the resource release process. So we want to make sure we don't actually stop it here. We just want to pause it. And then we're going to seek to zero, which will reset the track. And you can use this to seek to a certain point in this in a particular audio file. And then we're going to return out of the on click listener. And then otherwise we'll just start playing the song. So that will be media player dot start. And the only other thing we need to do is in our on destroy we want to release the resources from the media player. So that'll be if this media player is initialized media player dot stop and media player dot release. So that should be everything. I'm going to run the app now and once it's loaded up we should be able to play our audio file. So the app is now loaded back up. I'm going to go ahead and click the Pokemon icon here. And we can hear the song did play and after we click it again, um, the song does stop. We can click it again and it will restart playing. And if we navigate to another fragment and then come back and click it again, it still continues to play. So that is it for this video guys. That was how we can add a media player into our app and play a local audio file. If you have any questions, please post them down in the comments. Please like the video and please subscribe.